some sort of anxious or panic feelings. I know that they feel very overwhelming. And you might feel a little out of control, okay? And that's okay to feel that way, but we want to bring our awareness back to the present. If 
you have something near you that is either soft or nostalgic, you can grab that. Maybe you have a stuffed animal that you have around, you can hold that. You can either hold it, you can gently stroke it, but just have something to hold on to and ground you in where you are right now, okay? It's okay. It's okay, we're right here together. It's okay. you're holding if you decided to grab something and you can hold on to it for as long as it makes you feel safe and comforted, okay? That's okay. It's okay. It's okay. As a result, our body reacts. Sometimes it's hard to explain the physical effects of stress, panic, and anxiety unless someone has also experienced that very intense physical response that you can get with, you know, labored tight chest, um, fast breathing, um, your adrenaline spikes, um, you know, there's this, an intense sense of dread and it's all, you can even have, you know, chest, back, neck, arm pain, which, you know, may feel as if you're having some sort of heart attack or bad reaction and all of that can be caused by mental distress and 
so it is good to be able to calm your mind and try to regulate and calm yourself so your body begins to relax and ease up on those sorts of side effects. And so, relax, relax, it's going to be okay. It's okay. It's okay.
So oh. 